Welcome back and thank you for tuning in to Stadium Hot Dog. This episode will focus on West Ham United and the selection of footballing firsts at the London Stadium. After playing at Upton Park, known as the Bowling Ground, for 112 years, West Ham United moved into the London Stadium in the summer of 2016. There will be more in a separate video on Upton Park, which will be a part of the series on the old grounds of London's football clubs. And additionally, the London Stadium will appear in a series coming soon on the background of the current stadiums in London. The first West Ham game at the London Stadium was on the 4th of August 2016. It came in the UEFA Europa League third qualifying round second leg. Slovenian side NK Domzale were the visitors in front of a home crowd of over 53,000. West Ham were 2-1 down after the first leg, however they won this tie 4-2 on aggregate, winning 3-0 on the night. The first goal scorer at the London Stadium was the Senegal international Checo Kayate in the 8th minute, and then he netted his second goal in the 25th minute. In the 81st minute, Algerian international Sofiane Fagouli sealed the win for West Ham. The first away side to win at the London Stadium was Romanian side FC Astra Giorgio. On the 25th of August 2016, in the UEFA Europa League playoff round second leg, they defeated the Hammers by one goal to nil. Incidentally, the first away goal scorer at the ground was Filipe Texiera, who scored the winner that night. The Hammers failed to reach the Europa League group stage on this occasion as they lost a tie 2-1 on aggregate. The first Premier League game at the London Stadium was on the 21st of August 2016 when West Ham hosted Bournemouth. Nearly 57,000 fans watched on as Mikel Antonio netted the first Premier League goal at the ground in the 85th minute. The first away side to win the Premier League game at the London Stadium was Watford on the 10th of September 2016. The Hornets fought back to win 4-2. Goals from Mikel Antonio in the 5th and 23rd minutes gave the Hammers a cushion. However, goals from Agarlo in the 41st minute, which was incidentally the first Premier League away goal at the ground, and Troy Deeney in first half injury time levelled the game at the interval. Goals from Etienne Capu in the 53rd minute and Jose Holobas in the 63rd minute completed Watford's win. The first player in West Ham colours to score a hat-trick at the London Stadium was Tony Martinez. On the 15th of October 2017, in the Premier League 2 match against Manchester United, Martinez bagged his goals in the 24th, 45th and 48th minutes in front of a crowd of nearly 1,500. The first FA Cup match at the London Stadium was in the third round of the competition on the 6th of January 2017. Nearly 57,000 fans watched on as Manchester City beat West Ham by five goals to nil. The first FA Cup goal was scored by City's Ivorian international Yaya Toure from the penalty spot in the 33rd minute. A year on and West Ham would win their first FA Cup game at the London Stadium. On the 16th of January 2018, West Ham beat Shrewsbury by one goal to nil. In front of nearly 40,000 fans, Rhys Burke became the first West Ham player to score an FA Cup goal at the ground in the 112th minute. The first Women's Super League game at the London Stadium was on the 29th of September 2019. West Ham played their London rivals Tottenham Hotspur in front of nearly 25,000. The first WSL goal at the ground was scored by Tottenham's Rihanna Dean in the 36th minute. Lucy Quinn added a second for Spurs in the 84th, who went on to win the game 2-0. West Ham United women play the majority of their home games at Dagenham. There will be another series on women's football in London coming soon. Hey all, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe and share your thoughts on your experiences at the ground, both past and present, in the comments below. Stay well and see you next time.